We have been able to raise the voice for victims and families of survivors of torture. And we have walked that journey with over 6,000 victims over the last uh, 29 years. My name is Peter Kema. I work for the Independent Medical Legal Unit. I'm also a human rights defender in Kenya since uh, mid-90s. One of the major challenges that we face is the slow process of reforming our national police from a force to a service. Force has become the default mode of policing in this country. Young people in poor situations being labeled as suspects and therefore justification for torture. The torture becomes the way of policing. So part of the job we do is to continue giving hope to families and victims that it's not in vain that you are pursuing this. One day justice will be delivered.